Hey, what's going on? Welcome back to another Voice Tech video. And in this one, we're going to walk you through the process of deleting messages on your iPhone. Whether you want to free up some space or just clear out old conversations, I'm going to guide you through it step by step. Let's get started. At first, you can open up the messages app on your iPhone. And this is obviously where all of your chats are. To begin deleting messages, you can tap the three dots on the top right corner from the menu that appears, select the messages, and after selecting the conversations you want to delete, then you can tap on the trash can and delete icon, and these chats will be removed uh, from your main list. It is important to know that, that the deleted messages on your iPhone are not fully removed, but are instead hidden in a separate tab called recently deleted. To permanently delete a message, you'll need to take a few extra steps. So just come back to the main section and click on the filters or like the back option in the messages, which is going to get you to like the uh, different sections of your chats within iMessage. And you can tap on the recently deleted and there are going to be the chats which are actually removed. You have a little description there that um, uh, the, the after the time messages will be permanently deleted and this may take up to 40 days. It depends and you have a countdown of each chat within here so you can delete it if you want or recover them uh, okay so this is how you would do it now in case you want to make sure that the old messages uh, will be deleted automatically there is a way to do that too you can go to the settings app and navigate to the messages section scroll down until you find the keep messages section and you can choose how long the messages should be kept so it can be like 30 days or one year depending on what you want to set up but after let's say if you choose 30 days after one month all of the conversations that are going to be like removed and deleted from your iphone automatically so you don't even have to do anything also another thing would be to just go to the storage section and if you have like a lot of attachments in like stored on your iphone you might delete them so you just delete them from your iphone in here when you click on messages keep in mind that it, this doesn't mess with your actual chats it only like frees up storage on the downloaded attachment so in case you would scroll back within the conversation you can re-download all of the attachments and pictures so yeah these are the options that you have hope you found this tutorial helpful if you did make sure to hit the thumbs up subscribe below and i'll see you in the future